Hi YouTube, this is Wingman, and today we're going to be talking about tactical combat shirts. So we're going to cut away, I'll show you a tactical combat shirt up close, and we'll get the specs for you and some of the applications that we use it with. So come along to my tactical outdoor studio, and we'll showcase the proper tactical combat shirt. Okay, we're in the Wingman outdoor studio, we're showcasing uh, the combat shirts made by proper this is our ATAX version. I'm currently wearing the multi-cam version. This shirt is made out of a couple different fabrics. Okay, let's start with the sleeves of what they're made out of. They're made out of a 65% polyester and a 35% cotton ripstop. Almost like the um, BDU pants and the combat jackets that are out there. Now the torso is made out of 60% cotton and a 40% polyester knit and they've come up with a fabric that will wick away moisture and kind of cut down on the odor because this shirt is designed to be worn under body armor now I'm using it in applications like hunting out in the woods which is great especially on hot days you know I showcased a video where uh, I went squirrel hunting and I'll post it in top corner where I'm wearing the multi-cam shirt and it worked really great in a warm environment. Now the shoulders are gusseted so you have a lot of range of motion. Comes with your standard unit patch velcro on, on both arms. You have a ton of pockets on the sleeves of these shirts. Now you have one up here shoulder pocket that's zippered. I mean, there's a ton of room in there that you can see. And the zippers function very well. They're very ergonomic. Uh, there's one down here by the wrist that opens up. And they're gusseted, so you could put a lot of stuff in there. There's a Velcro pocket, a short one, that kind of goes the length of my fingers down to about here. And Velcro shut. The same goes on the other side, except they have pen holders to go in there and the same thing it's got zipper and it has a zipper there now it also has the classic elbow pad slots on each arm where you know obviously if you're using this in a combat situation you know you could put elbow pads in there and one feature that it has is these wrist and hand um, fabric that kind of goes over and covers the back of your hands you know if you look at the multi-cam one let me loosen this up you know you can pull it down like that and then cinch it down and then that's how it looks just something to kind of hide the color of your hand a little bit more you know things are sticking out that it, the white of your hand would show you know probably faster than you would see anything else so that's a nice feature as well um, in the front has a nice quarter zip that comes down and on the back it has velcro for a name tape or whatever item that you want to put on there the sleeves like I showed are velcro they velcro open and closed and I must say that the range of motion in the shoulders when you're using it I find it very comfortable now I'm a short little stocky portly guy and I got pretty big shoulders and most shirts kind of tighten up around the shoulder area this one's fine it feels really well and I think it's due to that gusseted shirt area you know so this is a quick view of the combat shirts by proper this is wingman i thank you for watching and you folks have a great day